Hello, my people. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are okay. I hope you guys had a fantastic week. Welcome back to my channel. This is your girl, Chinonye. Uh, my subscribers, you guys are the bomb. New people, you're highly welcomed. Please subscribe to my channel. Just hit that button. Hit it. Hit it, guys. Please hit it and subscribe to my channel. Help your sister to grow. Just help me to grow. Just hit that button. Hit it. Hit it. And please give my videos thumbs up. Please like my videos after watching. Please, 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 please. And please put on your notifications so you'll be the first to know when I post a new video, guys. Thank you. And welcome back. Hmm. A Boka's wife, Cynthia, is such a sweet soul. I love that girl so, so, so much. The way she celebrated her husband on his birthday. Guys, can you see that picture? A is such a... From what I watched in that video, A Boka is such a child. Like, always behaving like a baby. Like, I don't understand. Are you serious? A Boka is such a child. So cute. They are both, they're cute together, guys. I love that couple. Yeah yeah i very much love and they are enjoying themselves yes there was ebuka's birthday and the lady did her best to celebrate the husband yeah she was all over the guy like <laughs> guys so nice so good to watch yeah then a lot of gates friends they were around i think i have the video i will show you guys how it went down i just so i'm just so happy for them like when you love somebody Ebuka is a handsome guy sha yeah and the woman too is a beautiful lady so very young and active yeah <laughs> that guy is actually cute to watch lots of them that's so nice guys see the video guys this is the video lots of gifts for birthday boy they went out on the lunch <laughs> with the kids <laughs> The guy had some fun, a lot of gifts actually. Family and friends were there to celebrate him. The guy got a lot of gifts, he had some fun. That's nice. Away from that, guys, my people, learn. a lot of things they happen for this life. If you don't know, you don't know. If they don't expose it to you, there's no way you will know. Hmm. Cha Cha Ike and her husband, guys. This lover exposed a lot of things that happened between them even before their marriage, how they started and how the marriage has been. Guys, I'm not even joking because it's not a funny thing. They are very nice and my goodness. Hmm. I don't believe I don't believe like I don't know how people would do such a thing. Guys, I read what this guy tweeted. Hmm. He said, Hello to it. To it. Now you all have been asking the, for the full gist without missing any words. Here we go. Chacha is a very fantastic actress and a household name in Hollywood. If Esteem brought her to Asaba from Potako to act, she was squatting with Eve because she just left her baby. Hmm. Which she had for an older man in Abakliki than for Potako. I am sure a lot of you do not know this part of her. When Eve brought her to Asaba, she didn't treat her well because she was making everyone know she was her boss and others are around. Making her carry her bags and all that when they are meet and act on the same um, movie set. Eve introduced her to Solo Amako as that one in turn sleep with both of them for rules. <laughs> Eve was also the one marking Austin then for more visibility. Austin was an editor by that, that time. <laughs> I hope you guys are listening. <clears throat> if you watch most Niger movies then, you will see how Eve's face was everywhere. Even when she was doing a worker pass, another actor will be talking. Actor will be talking, but it was Eve's face that you will be seeing. Chacha being a sharp Chacha being a sharp and desperate girl who wants her way to the top played a smart game on Eve did a kukere waka and snatched him knowing fully where he is gay gay like gay <laughs> it's not hidden to Eve and Chacha because they caught him times without numbers and he his excuse is that he's doing it 
because of money and all. They all know he is a gay. But he is a very calm gay. She knows that. But they were very compatible. Chacha was hungry, desperate and smart. Austin was very calm, a home-oriented gay. And he keeps her rooted. Hmm. Hey, God Almighty. Then he dumped Eve for Chacha, where the matter caused fights then. Hmm. Okay, guys. Chacha was the new favorite. That was how they turned a force of nature. Traveling to towns together to see men. Chacha was sensational already then. Very, every PH militant and politician wants to, to do her. Austin goes with her as her manager. College do. Sleeps in another room while his girlfriend entertains the paying customer. Then they go back home very rich and happy until Oga Austin Nakambele. That was the beginning of their war. Hey, Jesus. Then she got pregnant for Austin and fear of the unknown. Fear of those rich men funding their life made them to agree that all through her pregnancy they got a concussion, more like drugs, and she was drinking that for the fear of adding weight. She was mostly working with Uche, Uche, Nancy, and Ike, or Diffiden. She was so addicted to that, that thing that it started staining her teeth and mouth. Then she hasn't married Fanny. They were only doing crookery, and he had gotten her pregnant. The militant man, Nahim, buying them their first car, loud car, got Venza for Chacha, got Toyota Spider Camry for Austin, thinking Austin and Chacha manager, stroke brother, as introduced to him by Chacha. Chacha also told him about uh, Austin getting married. But she, she not tell him, say, <laughs> now she Austin, they get married too. The mama gave them a lot of money. Pastor Suleiman. Yay. Pastor Suleiman. Always in sex scandal. This pastor again. This pastor again. Ha. Pastor Suleiman was also in the picture. Codedly. Before you know it, the news of their wedding broke out in Asaba. Some of the some of the men some of the men got angry. Say Chacha don't run them straight. Because he made them to be funding Austin too. Funny thing we say, all these men are married men. After their wedding, the PH militant got angry and promised to cause havoc. Then begin begging. Few weeks after their wedding, this militant man cornered them and collected the car, the cars he bought for them, and left FJ Cruiser for them. Hmm. That was how the other couples go. They gave birth and things were no longer were not the same way it used to be. Chacha had to go back to the streets. <laughs> and Austin is 100% away of it. And in support, so far, she brings him money. More like an open marriage. All along, Chacha and Austin had an agreement that he will not, he will stop knocking Yash, that's gay, since he is doing it because of money. And she, Chacha, will be providing for the house. Not knowing, say, Austin played her and pretended he had stopped, but he didn't. Chacha got back to the street, and that was how her affair with Pastor Suleiman got real. Suleiman got lodger and other girls for hotel. Them do threesome, do all sorts. Also will be at the home taking care of the kids. He's a very homely gay. Before you see Jack Robinson, Pastor Suleiman, bought her a house she was really boiling them jesus and it's said to be continued that means the story never end he still has more to, to bring to the table but guys a lot have been said already pastor slay man is always on sex scandal what's wrong with that man safe pastor what is happening in this life and i don't understand anymore chacha Iki running the streets in marriage and her husband, gay, Austin, funny, gay. Ha. Oh, good God, oh, my people. 
going to help me talk this one. I don't tire. <laughs> the thing tire me, eh? tire me. Serious pass me, Jari. A lot of things they happen. If essen. So, what this thing they say, and all these Nollywood and ladies, they sleep to, to give one up. To. Hmm. Oh, goodness me, my people. Oh, please oh, give me your opinion in this thing. <laughs> Just give me what you think. <laughs> because I don't tire. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys so much. Yes, so if you have not subscribed, please let me to subscribe. I love you guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.